four-month-old male infant is brought to the clinic because of excessive noisy respiration. On examination, the infant is within the normal range of growth, appears healthy, and does not show respiratory distress. Phonation is normal, along with head and neck examination findings. However, the child displays strider, high-pitched breathing sound, on inspiration, accentuated in the supine position. The parents report that the same strider is heard during feeding or when the child is agitated. The attending physician places the child in the prone position and the strider is relieved. To confirm, she holds the child in a neck extended position, which also relieves the strider. An endoscopic laryngeal examination reveals bulky arytenoids cartilages and the diagnosis of laryngomalacia is established. During development, the arytenoids cartilages arise from which of the following? You can pause this video, answer the question, and come back for the correct answer and explanation. Okay, the correct answer here is E. The arytenoid cartilages arise as swellings from the sixth pharyngeal, that is sixth bronchial, arch, at 32 days of gestation. They are located between the caudal end of the hypobronchial eminence and the cranial end of the laryngotracheal tube. The swellings will grow cranially to form the arytenoids and corniculate cartilages along with the primitive aryepiglottic folds. In laryngomalacia, the bulky arytenoids cartilages prolapse and tear immediately on inspiration, resulting in strider.